Hello, everybody, and welcome to the episode that starts with a three and ends with a three. That's right, it's episode 3,333,300. It's episode 33. And today, we're waiting for the trader to open, so I'm gonna cut down trees until that occurs. I hear a snake. It's a sneaky snake. Oh, I hit it so hard that it killed it and looted it at the same time. Weird. You know, maybe the next session won't be completely vanilla. I was thinking, I think I had mentioned in the last episode, that I might do a compo pack. Which means that there's a whole bunch of new POIs to go through. Crazy POIs with almost too many zombies in some of them. But that's half the fun. But I was also thinking of doing the traders are open all day. Or all night, more specifically. Because I find it quite annoying that I can't do my quests unless it's daytime. Quite annoying. Scrap that radiator. Take the cloth. Mm, cloth. Trader should be open at what, 6.05? Is that the time? I believe it's 6.05. I was also thinking if I'm going to add mods, I should probably add in the one that allows you to craft from boxes nearby, aka the storage broadcasting system. Trader Joel's. We meet again. Close the door. But yes, the storage broadcasting system. So if I had a box right here next to this wall and I was standing over here, then I could craft things in my inventory using stuff inside that box. This imaginary box that I placed over there. Which is just a major convenience. It's not exactly game breaking. Two buried supplies and three zombies. We'll do the buried supplies because they're faster and I have to sell stuff. Restocks on day 34, so I don't need to mess with anything there. Sell this and that. One of these. Some of those. Why not this? How about that? Not the auger. Not the engine either. But it is taking up a lot of inventory space. Sell the headlights. Goodbye, headlights. It was fun knowing you. Great doing business with you. Yes, business. Now let me go dig up all the drugs that you buried in the ground. Oh, I did it. I did the double tappy and the thing happened. Let's try that again. Ooh, it worked again. Does it only work with big doors? Ooh. Ooh. I'll have to try it at the other traders. Maybe I just wasn't doing it fast enough. Oh no. If you look in the lower left, according to my HUD, I'm 100% umbrella right now, and I think that's bad. I've also got five minutes of knee spikes, and my shirt is weak. It's gonna be an interesting day. Oh, something truly rare has occurred. I've become hungry. Let's eat some grilled corn. Seven grilled corn should do for now. I would assume. And now I'm thirsty. Oh, how the tables turn. And if you're a DJ, how the turns table. Now, wh where are my drinks? Red tea. Gimme, gimme. Time to equip the auger. Yes. Auger equipping. Let's get to the good part. Mm -hmm. Diggy, diggy. Oh. oh, I must have modified this because it didn't have any gas in it. Also, mountain lion. I'm not letting you sneak up on me. Come on, let's play. Come on, a little closer. Come on, buddy. Come on, we're going to be the best of friends. Here, kitty, kitty. Dead kitty, kitty. But is it dead? Yeah, I think so. I think that scrunched up neck means it's dead. I shot it so head that... I shot it so head, I shot it so hard that its head became part of its body. Hm. I shot it so head. All right, auger time. Wee! Down we go. Let's try not to make a grave for myself like we did last time. Oh, I'm used to being at three times the player structure damage, so <laughs> normally augers just one shot every block they come in contact with. Oh, there we go. There's the thing. Let's get the auger ready for the next spirit supplies. Reload. Reloading! Let's see. Blueberry pie. Because I didn't have to eat any food. Yuka. Yucca? Yuka. Yuck. Yucca. You. Yuka. Yucky. Ooh, ooh. A good time for the boy. I can't wait to get these perks maxed out and have two of the boy, aka the boys. But for now, this will do. It will do. All right. Don't fall in the hole. Don't fall in the hole. Okay. I'm okay. terrible at riding this thing. Thought I might have just ditched myself. Well, this equates to, I believe, six quests as of last episode. This will be the seventh quest done for this trader. We're doing science now to figure out exactly how many quests it takes for us to open trade routes with this guy. Joel's holding out on me, regardless of how many drug runs I do for him. If it continues past ten, he may have to pay the price. The kind of price that the zombies have been paying, where they get removed from existence, from me and my axe. 
Mm, my ass. Joel, I've gotten more of your strange berry drugs. 762. Vitamins. A schematic. Trigger group semi-mod. No, I'll take the ammo, I guess. Ammo. Yes, we did the thing. The thing is happening. It's happening. Everybody is happening. Book bundle, water filters. I'll take the book bundle. Far more valuable than anything else. Open Friend. those trade routes. Really? You open those trade routes. Joel, you dirty girl. It was fun taking care of all your drug runs. But now it's over. Our relationship ends here. Let's read some books. All books I've read. Joel, our relationship has been reopened like a wound that could never fully close. I just can't keep my hands away from you. Okay, so that, that, this. Drop this. I think that's it. You want some murky water? No? Hmm. Damn. Go Thought you might like that. my gamer girl bath water. But it's okay. I left it on the counter for you, Joel. Now our relationship ends. I never want to speak to you again. Where's my bicycle? Oh, on the other side. Well, I can't wait to get out of this frozen hell, and into a burning hell, where all of your dreams come true. If your dreams consist of burning, digging, collecting oil, like a madman gone oil baron. Otherwise, to sum up everything I just said, getting oiled up for the occasion. No, oh, shopping carts. I keep almost hitting all the shopping carts left around here. Oh, I look forward to leaving. Ah, the long trip to what is for sure going to be the desert biome. I hurt my bike again. Also, brr. Hey, this is the shotgun messiah I spent the night in. Fun times. All of my injuries are healed, so that's good. I should probably stay on the road and keep an eye out for more mailboxes, shouldn't I? That sounds like a, a big brain kind of thing to do. Yeah, I guess so. It seems like it's all shops around here. It's all popping pills and shotgun messiahs and super malls. Oh, the future is taking over. Ooh, 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 ooh. Mailbox in the middle of the street. Mailbox. What do we have? Pistol Pete. Some crap. Paper, handy land, and wire. Ugh, my disappointment is immeasurable. Ooh, another Pupulice car. Ooh, mailboxes. It's like Christmas just hit. Oh, well, I guess Christmas has been here. That's the kind of biome we're in. It's always Christmas here. Where's everybody's Christmas spirit? Ooh. Yikes. Took his hand and then his arm. Mm, I see why they don't have much Christmas spirit. Batter up, don't care. Fireman's Almanac, reduce the chance to be lit on fire. Mm, don't mind if I do. What do we have here? Another batter up. And a wasteland treasures. Oh, I already have that one. The one with the acid and stuff. <sighs> I shouldn't. I wouldn't. I couldn't. But I will. Hee <laughs> hee. Let's get the zombies. Oh, let's drop the boy real quick. You know what? I got a bunch of bullets. Let's use them. Just narrowly dodge some cop spit. Hey, big guy. Ouch. Don't go boom. Oh, good. I killed him before he went boom. Hmm. Oh, there's more of them. But these ones aren't running, so it's time to use my steel ass. Steel shovel, I already have one. Garbage. Alright, let's see what all this trouble was worth. A robotic turret tier 1. Not enough, but I can scrap it for robotic parts. Which is enough. Drink some water, and I got all my bullets, plus more, back. That is indeed a victory. Now then. Let's go. Only 400 meters until the desert, for sure. It will not, in fact, be another winter trader. I'm sure of it. As you get closer and closer to the center of town, your frame rate starts to tell you just how many zombies are around. Bars. Mailbox. Wasteland treasures. Is this... Is that the last one? Yes, yes. You keep grumbling and walking toward me, but I'm a little busy. Wasteland treasures. No? Dab. A little more. Almost to time. Two to go. Trader. Hello, trader. I'd like to do some quest for you. I crack a buck. Crack a cafe. I gotta mark this real quick while I'm still moving. Right here. You. You. Oh, crap. What do we... Uh, we'll do this. The house. Uh, crack. Good. Executed perfectly. Calmly. He. 
That's all it said. That's all that shall ever be is he. All right. Oh, is this another gen? Oop. Sorry about that. Didn't mean to take out your hay bale with my bicycle. Hmm. I couldn't speed close that one. You know what? I don't care about the local loot. I'm here for a traitor. Jen, 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 I'm here for your quest. Also, it's yet another traitor in the winter biome. I wonder how long they're gonna make me play the runaround. This desert biome's really playing hard to get. All right, Jen, I have quests. I mean, you I have quests, and I want to do them. Oh, she's already got opening trade routes. Does this Jen count as the same you. Jen? What is happening? What has my life become? Here, take all this random crap. Thanks. I didn't want any. What do you got? Books? Bow hunter. Don't care. Needle and thread. Read this. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna start taking these. One day, it may even be useful. Just not today. Beaker. Nice. Ammo and weapons. She's got some iron knuckies. A steel club. Compound crossbow. Kind of tempting, actually. A little bit. A lot of bit. Hmm, I don't have the money on me. Also, I'm not a crossbow man. I'm a man of the land. I kill with my pick ass and my steel ass. I'm an ass man. A slightly better iron helmet. That's all you have to offer? Bye. I just knew you'd find something you'd like. I found a thing. Hmm, zombies at the door. You know what? <laughs> Jen, you can have him. I'll leave him there. I'm not. I'll never be back at this Jen anyway. Maybe she'll show him what exactly a tickle doctor does. Aw, oh, you can't give me a two-pointer like this and expect me to just pass right by. Right in the middle of the road, too? Oh, man. Too tempting. Sick. Oh, savage country. I thought that said secure country for a moment. You know, I've been trying. I'm terribly imperceptive. Oh, it's another poo-poo lice car. Oh, why'd you have to do me like this? Now I have to get it. Lion! Lion? That's not a gun. That's a gun. Uh, it's not a lion either. Well, it is. Come here. Come on. Oh, I thought it would take four shots. As long as you get a sneak attack in the hand, it's just three shots. Nice. I don't even need to kill and collect from them, because I'm a man of the land. Anyways, let's get the bicycle away in case that thing blows up. It's happened once, now I'm going to expect it every single time. Here we go, fun times. Come on. Hey, hey, hey. Ouch. Missy, relax. Ouch. Damn copper. Probably worth the bullets. These cop cars tend to be loaded. Another abrasion. My knee has become spiky, according to the HUD. Oh, uh, we got other gun ammo, I guess. If I ever get a Magnum, I'm just gonna use it until I run out of ammo. That's my usual pattern with those, because I use them so infrequently, or I get them so infrequently, and I get the ammo so frequently, that it's just... I don't know. There's this weird obsession with the loot pools for giving 44 ammo. I don't understand it. But you always get it en masse. Is that another cracker book or is this the one I already marked? We have... Oh. Hmm. I'm already here. I guess I'll get it. Hello. 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 Oh. There's been a pretty heavy uptick of ferals recently. It appears as though I'm hitting that game stage. Mm, rough light. Oh, that reminds me. Have I gotten a level in the last episode or so? No, it would appear not. I had marked this in expectation that I'd have to quest and that I'd spend the night here, looting and reading aggressively. But instead, I'd rather not leave the area without catching a few good stories, reading a few good books, which all appears to be about clubs. It's all clubs, all the time. Oh yes, I'd like a mocha frappy. Is that how it's pronounced? Can you tell me how it's pronounced? Ooh, she left this plane of existence. I'll never know how to pronounce frappy. Rich. I don't need to loot this, I'm just here for the books. Cardboard box, what do you got? Rotting meat. Wonderful. I should probably speed loot this. It's still good to get as many quests as possible done with the next trader, who will be the desert trader, for sure. Are you feral? No? Okay. Oh, but we have a popo. A dead popo. Paper? Anything in here? I crack a book book. Box? A box? A box of books? A book of boxes? Behold. My box. 
box. It is like many other boxes, but it is special in the sense that this box is my box. Lucky Looter 7. How are we doing on that series? Luck oh, not even close. Well, that one gave me more medical supplies and loot. It's not terrible. Not amazing, but not terrible. One more point to heavy armor. I don't know when, but I guess I leveled up. Right. Let's check the roof real quick. Oh, my frame rate. Hello. Is there anybody here? Oh, somebody's taking a nap. I don't Let's see if we can get a sneak attack on him. He's irradiated and everything. Can I reach from here? Nope. Guess not. Let's try real sneaky like. You stay right there, buddy. Ooh. Oh, oh, dang it. I was hoping to kill him all sneaky deaky like, but that's not really my style, I guess. Screw it. Let's alert everybody. Hello? Anybody want to play? Hey, buddy. Oh, we have a whitey. Ooh, now he's a daddy. Why do they hide the trash like this? Why? One of the great mysteries of the universe? No. I saw that ladder, or that set of stairs, and I thought it was a... Well, something more dangerous than stairs. Huh. Nothing of great worth on this roof. Perhaps the hole in the ceiling will have better stuff. Oh, oh look at this. Adorable. Let's get it. Books. Ah, my box. Oh wait, I just got the sound for finishing a series. Which one? Is it batter up? No, I think I already had that one. Fireman's Almanac? No. Shotgun Messiah? Already had that. Yard of Mining? Already had that. What did I finish? Oh well, whatever. I don't care anymore. Oh, you see him over there? Let's see if I can sneak up on him. Biker man, biker man. Ooh, dead biker man. Ooh, they're actually letting me do it. They're letting me do it. <laughs> oh. Come on, come on, guys. Just stay asleep. I've already sneak attacked three of your buddies. Just join the gang. Peer pressure. Peer pressure. Ah, the power of peer pressure. Done. Easy peasy. That's all of them, right? I think so. Medicine. What do we got? A book. Probably more important than the medicine itself. Drop the stone, scrap the chair, read that book. And I guess I'll take the first aid kit, not that I need it. I can actually just use it now, so it doesn't take up an inventory slot. It's a good idea. Green dye? Not for me. Hey, what are you doing? Be in a locked door. Oh yeah, I can hit through these, right. Well, I could have hit through it. Oh, right back to the entrance. Nice. What was I doing? Books. Boxes. Boxes of books. Books of boxes. Black die, don't mind if I do. Let's see. I have a turret and I want it painted black. There we go. A cracker book. The undebatably most valuable POI that exists in the game. Ooh, more black dye. Hmm, I see. I have a M60 and I want it painted black. Cool. Last book? Oh, no, I already got this book. Okay. Now we just rummage through the front of the store again. Who? Where? Why? What happened? Somebody grumbled at me. Were they back here? Did somebody want to play? Hello? Hello? Oh, you know, I almost missed an essential piece of loot right here. Let's open this door. Military man. Doing everything a military can. Who grumbled at me? You know what? I don't care. I'm here for loot. I'm sure all the noise I make will... Oh, a mo. You here to read a book? Too bad. I'm borrowing that book right now. He didn't bring his library card. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yet another locked chest. Learning is... Ooh, forge ahead. Learning is lesson. I, I don't need this. Bye. Steel club. Don't need it. Bye. I'll take the rest of it, though. Also, crack this box so we can crack a few books. Nothing of great worth. Maybe the garbage will have a secret book in it again. No? Damn. We're not quite there yet. Well... Let's go ahead and check all the shelves. And once we're done with that, this BOI is basically done for. Here's zombies outside. Oh, another mo. Hmm, there's a lot of mo's in this area. Listen, buddy. I'm busy I'm trying to read a book. Do you mind? Oh my goodness. It's all the books that I've already basically mastered. Except for Armored Up. That was a nice one. It was only the special loot that actually gave me a forge ahead. Hmm. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Other than negatively. Well, let's just keep an eye out for mailboxes as we move along. Paper, of course. Why didn't I think it would be that? Alright, since I cleared that crack a book, I should probably remove it from my HUD. Crack? Goodbye. 
You were fun while you lasted. Ooh, I bumped into this barrier. It's a pretty good barrier. Yes, 470 meters away. That's where the desert is, for sure. I know it. It has to be true. It's the only reality that could exist. There's no way that all the traders on my map are in the snow biome. There's just no way. I would legitimately be upset about that. Because that's not cool, man. It's just not cool. Is this bringing me back to the same trader that I was at? I don't think it is, but it almost seems like it. It is. Oh my goodness. Why did it say it was opening trade routes? My spaghetti is beyond upsetty. Can the same trader ask you to open trade routes more than once? Because I might just go back to my original gen. That might be the idea. Yeah. That's seeming like the idea. Because this just brought me back to the same exact trader. Joel? I said that our relationship had ended, but it appears as though the universe wants Howdy. me back here. Great job. Great. Should I do more quests for him? I'll just go back to my original gen. I think that's a sensible idea. Because this is clearly not working for me. Should I go back to the other gen? Yeah. If we do quests for her, it'll last open trade routes again. Right? I think so. What a confusing day, where most of it has spent, or been spent, Reading books and riding my bicycle. Mm, my wonderful bicycle. Uh, no, no, I'm thinking, forget this trader. I'm going to go back home. Yes, let's go home. Let's go off-road, off the beaten path, which apparently just led to another beaten path. I see. From now on, I will simply take any and all opening trade routes quests from Jen, as I do normal quests for. Seems like a sensible idea, at least to me. I suppose I could just wander the map without the intent of finding a trader in the desert. That might actually be a good idea. I can't say that these trips have been entirely fruitless because, well, I've gotten a handful of Forge Ahead books that I probably wouldn't have gotten just standard quest prop. Mm -mm. Got the flu? End it with Z, side plus. Interesting. Military checkpoint. Let's see if I can go over this railing. <laughs> hops, 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 hops. Come on, hops. BMX. Nope. All I can do is really break my bike. We'll just go around the check. I doubt there's many books in there anyway. I'm on the road again. Can't wait to get on the road again. For those of you who might be wondering, yes, that's the only part of the song that I know because I watched the Shrek movie and that's the only part of the song that most people know. <laughs> I have heard it before, but I'm not one for actually remembering lyrics or remembering anything really. What do we have in this supply shop? Ooh, a forge ahead. Mysteriously worth it. Another farm bundle, coffee, and corn. Not terrible, but not amazing. Gonna do myself a favor and use this first aid kit to clear up some space. I'll also drop these feathers. Take this book, crack it open. Ooh, two forge ahead, so those can have it. Amazing, it's a Christmas miracle. Now then, back to blazing my own trail. Huh, I can see the standard biome loading back in. You know, maybe I will actually spend the night just going, where, where have I gone? from home. So we have home, and I've gone south and started going in a circle. I've also gone pretty far north. Why? Oh, that's where I started, hence the bed. So I guess I could go east or west. West might be the idea. We'll get home and then we'll just head straight west. Straight west. We'll figure it out. Although it's been a relatively uneventful episode, I will say this. We've learned something today. The trader's opening trade routes quest like everything else in the game, is bugged. It will lead you from one trader to a second trader, and then back to the first trade. Wonderful. I'm not sure what benefit it serves, but I'm sure it's very important that you bounce back and forth between all the traders. Hmm. Feels good to be back in the Greenlands. Now I can check on my potatoes. Mm, potatoes. I don't have my knife on me. That's what I used to use to collect these. Am I gonna have to use my hammer now? Or my pick? Which one swings the fastest? Potato, potato. Is the pickaxe faster? That's about the same. How about the shovel? Everything seems to be about the same speed. Just about. Which is too bad. More potato seeds. Wonderful. The empire expands. Yes, the empire expands. <laughs> I wonder how Jen is doing. More importantly than anything else. Jimmy, have you been lonely? Because I've been lonely. I missed you, Jimmy.
Well, I need to make room in my inventory. I have a lot of sorting to do. I have a lot of everything to do, really. Here, take all of that. Just take it. I don't need any more. I have like 90 bullets in my... I should have like 90 bullets in my gun. Did I modify this? Oh, right. I wanted to paint it black. And that apparently needed to come with the effect of removing all of its bullets. Makes sense to me. All right. Well, I'm amassing a lot of ammo from just looting. Whoa, look at them shells. Damn. I do have a magnum. I'd rather get a different one. Wait, is there anything other than the .44 in vanilla? Do they have the vulture? Or is it just this? Maybe I'll have to switch to this for a while. Although it doesn't seem like I'm getting the absolutely ludicrous amount of magnum ammo I normally do. Hmm. I have some thinking to do, which is terrible because I'm not good at thinking. Well, we don't need all of this turret ammo on us. One stack per trip should do. Speaking of which, I have to find a lead ore vein. I do indeed need to do many things. Eat some corn. The most important of all, continue to consume the absolute ludicrous amount of corn that you have. That's the plan, survivor. Food. Ah, the magic of hitting the take my stuff button. This upper left miscellaneous resource chest really does most of the heavy lifting. Now, since that is taken care of, drink some tea, put the engine in the electric eye chest. Yes. Wonder. And... We should visit Jen before everything closes. Jen, give me a quest. Give me a quest. Actually, I don't know why I want a quest. It's not the plan for tonight. I finally got home. I should uh, sit back. The weather. Relax. Wait a second. So, she just let me take another opening trade routes, but I haven't done any quests for her since the last one. Does that mean that she's just going to keep giving those to me? From, like, all the backlogged stuff that I've done? Where is this trade route she w Oh, north. North. Interesting. She's trying to lead me back to this guy in the middle of nowhere. I'm confused. Well, let's finish up the farm, and then I think we might actually spend the night just riding to the north. Yes. Let's ride to the north. We're gonna ride to the north, Jimmy. Well, I am. You're gonna stay here. Cool. I need to feed you more iron, don't I? Yes, I do. Make more steel. Always make steel. Oh, I need to get more iron. Oh, I have so many things to do, and only but one survivor to do it. Should I go in the mine and get iron for tonight? Yes, it'd probably be best to leave this cooking things, rather than just leaving it empty. <sighs> but then tomorrow would be the day before the horde day, and we wouldn't want to run off the day before horde day. Ooh, corn. Gimme, 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 gimme that too. You ran out of wood, you poor, poor campfire. Let me fix that. Just take some out of the forge and put it in here. There we go. You keep cooking that corn for the next hour and a half. I'm glad that there's some disembodied spirit that continues to take the corn off the fire for me. I really appreciate that. Well, all of this goes in the corn hub. Bye. Let's open this up. Oh, we really need... Wow, I finished the farming books. Go me. Hops? Don't care. Paper? Oh, from the book. Pumpkin? Super corn? Sure. Why not? The bicycle has some of that too. Open her up. More of this. Pumpkin, yes, get rid of the hops. I'm not gonna be making beer, it's not the kind of person I am. You know what, just keep the food in there. It's good for trips. Let's take that anvil out. You, stop that cooking right now, mister. Take this anvil. Let's do a little comparison. It's gonna take 45 minutes, just about, to make all of that. But if I put this in there, 23 minutes. Yeah, I guess I have another excuse to get iron. Hmm. Opening trade routes will be reserved for after the next horde night. Also, didn't I have a door here? Oh, door. Nice. Well, let's expand the little bit of farm blood business we have going on. There's a lot of things to do. As you can see, this titanic field of radiated corn. It looks radiated to me. I don't know why. Because it's so glowy. Add on to the fact that I need to make more farm plots. I'll start that process, but before I do that, let's do, 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 and do collect. 33, that's a lot. Let's get some bones, bones. And now we sacrifice it to the great campfire gods to make glue. Here you go, glue. And then we put the bones away. One of these should have my rotting flesh. Here we go. Give me all that. Now, where's my nitrate? Where, oh, where could my nitrate be? And a little bit of clay. And here we have it. Farm plot crafting. Apparently it takes wood. I didn't know that. Weird. Oh, I have wood. Boy, do I have wood. I've got wood for days. For days.
bones. I've got wood for days, Jimmy. 64? That's far more than I'll ever need. Let's do it. I want, I want so many. I need a different chest for every single resource. I've already gone too far. I can't stop here. I need more corn. Truly, it is too much corn. So much corn. I don't think I'll ever actually need as much corn as I have. Mm, but here we are. Now then, all you can do with super corn is glue. i just like to confirm that with myself. Glue, and some other stuff that I'll probably never make. Maybe the awesome sauce. Or the moonshine for damage mitigation? Is that right? I think so. But glue. So now I... well, now the bones don't serve a purpose. Why am I making super corn? What use does super corn have? Hmm. Some questions can never be answered, it seems. And that is going to be one of them. But I have it. I have lots of corn. I might need a separate chest just for super corn. Let's make that. Forge. You have nails. Gimme. And I have wood, so I can make those storage chests right now. What I can use this for? We'll make three. Another stack. Gosh golly gee, this is just too much corn for me. Corn hub and the corn hub plus. It's like a subscription service where you get superior corn. That's a screamer. Problem. Missy, relax. Did anyone spawn in? Hello. 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 Hello, hmm, I see. Goodbye. Hmm, these other chests will be renamed later. For now, we have the subscription service and everything else is taken care of. Put the nails back. We'll simply make and name the chests as we need. Hmm. You know, I could spend the night digging. Aggressive. I like that idea. Let's do that. There's only so much time in the night left anyway, and I have to make farm plots. So, I'll see you all after I've recovered from the time lapse. Never mind, I have other things to do. <laughs> I thought it was all over. I thought my life was done. My work, my work was done. And I could get back to digging a hole. But I can't. It's not hole digging time. Not yet. We're not there yet. <sighs> I'll see you when the shrooms have been collected. Boom. Shroom. I guess I still have to plant them, actually. 70? I don't think I need 70 seeds. How many shrooms did I get? Two and a half stacks? And I already have 24. I think a total of 50 is fine. So we'll do 26 shrooms. That's 25 on each wall. Cancel the farm plot block so that those can start crafting. It'll take much less time for that. Make room for shrooms. Once all of this is done, it should be a truly excessive amount of vegetables for vegetable stew. And I have yet to even look up exactly how good a vegetable stew is. I probably should. But for the time being, I'm just trusting that it's better than eating straight grilled corn for the rest of my life. Probably. No! Shrooms on the ceiling. Get off of that. Silly. Silly little cave nipples. You go on the wall. Yes. I believe that's all the shrooms. That's yeah, almost enough. We'll make another ten or so. Yeah, another ten or so. If I have to, if I've overcrafted, then I will put them on the ceiling or the floor. Probably the floor first. Yes, the floor sounds good. And ten. That was actually the perfect amount. Wonderful. It's already daytime. I didn't get to dig. Damn. It's my favorite part. Well, it's been an interesting episode. Ah, uh, the ding-a-ring-dong. Go ahead and take this corn before it overflows. You know, we could see exactly vegetable stew. How do you do? Potatoes, corn, shrooms. You know, we don't have many potatoes, so I guess I'll pass. Well, actually, no. No, I'm very curious. Two potatoes. Oh, that's corn hub plus. Two corn. And I have got loads of shrooms. But I just need two of them. One, two the others away. Put the cooked corn away. Corn, shrooms, potatoes. What else do we need? Water. Easy. Easy peasy. I'm sure one of the dew collectors has got more, right? At least one. One dew collector. Just one. No? Hmm. We certainly live in a society. Where's my water? Certainly I must have one. At least one water. <laughs> it's gotta be at least the moist box. Right. 
Give me one of those. I will reset up the corn and the... Maybe I should just have a second campfire. Yes. Yes, I should. Stone box. Give me stones. Okay, I'm off by one. Give me one stone. Craft. Here we go. Now this lonely, lonely little campfire has a friend. And it needs cooking pots and the like. Well, you know what? That will be a task for episode 34. This has been episode 33. And thank you all for joining me on it, because it was a strange one. But I am sure the next one will be far more eventful. I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I will see you next time. Bye bye